Hi everyone, my name is Vinit Pawar. I am a senior data analyst at Adden Analytics. So today in this video we are going to see how to create the DAX for uh, cumulative sales. So let's have a look. So first as you can see I have created this visual. So in the visual I have dropped the date column from the date table and the sales column from the sales col table which is the sum of sales. So let's create the measure. Okay, so we'll give it a name. Cumulative cumulative sales index measure. So in the previous video we showed the cumulative sales using the calculate column. So that's why we are giving you it a name as tax measure. So let's give it calculate sum of sales which will be sales column. Now we will use the filter function here. So first we will need to remove all the filters from the date table. So that it, uh, no filter will be applied. And now the date from the date table has to be less than or equals to the max date. So the max date will be the next date on this row, on the row level date table plus the bracket close the bracket for calculate and then hit enter this measure will work in the similar way okay yep so as you can see for the first of january the sales was 35000 and the say for the second of january it was 48000 so as you can see the sales on second is the sum up of previous two values similarly for the third of January it is the sum of previous three sales so in this way we can like uh, create the measure for cumulative total sales or uh, cumulative uh, quantity or anything like if you wanted to calculate it uh, cumulatively so in this way you can create the dex measure which will work for all the dates so thanks for watching